Well, Mental Health Awareness Month has come and gone. People of all ages face internal struggles each and every day. Fox 43's Alex Colley shines the sports spotlight on a former NFL athlete who gives kids a safe place to open up in hopes of saving lives. Mark McMillan has faced some of the best players the NFL has ever seen. Fake to Sanders, and then it is intercepted, deflected, picked off by Mark McMillan. But few challenges can rival holding the attention of a school of kids with only one day left before summer break. Everything I do, I, I go 100% the same way uh, I played the game of football. You know, when I put my mind to it and uh, have great people around me as well, amazing things happen. When one plays in Alabama and then the NFL, they usually don't spend much time on the bench where players are always ready. Now McMillan hopes this friendship bench is always ready to save lives. The Live Foundation, our objective is to, you know, create a safe place for these kids to be able to come and, and hang out and for the uh, peers as well as their teachers to be able to recognize when something is going wrong. Suicide rate is so high right now with kids, nobody really knows what's going on in these kids' minds. For years, McMillan has been coming to Lancaster County to host football camps to help kids with their physical health. Good. Now we got to finish it. Camp 29 that we've been running now for four years in Lancaster County. And the proceeds we wanted to take and make an impact with any extra money because we're a nonprofit. Every time we have a camp here, we're going to be putting a bench in Lancaster County. Seeing the signs of bullying, depression, or even suicidal thoughts can be tough. So if a child simply sits down on the bench, it's a sign to their classmates and teachers that they need help or just want to talk. Even if they're feeling lonely at home and they need somebody to, to be able to talk to, we don't want any kid to feel alone. No kid should feel alone. With more camps comes more benches in Lancaster County and beyond. It's a day McMillan looks forward to repeating with one exception. Everything uh, went, ran real smooth, like I said, besides the priest being a Raven fan. Alex Colley, Fox 43. This one tomorrow? 